there's a very in, uh, important in Yan in um, that Perkei teaches, and that is, and I quote you four wor- five words. What's the five words? Al tihi baz lekol adam. Shein lach adam, shein lo sha'a. What does that mean? What does that mean? So the person, en lebazot leshum bad Yisrael. You're not allowed to disgrace. You're not allowed to make light of anybody in Kali Yisrael. You can't go ahead and, 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 and make a bizayon. You know bizayon? A disrespect a person. Any person. The guy, the guy no matter who he is. No matter, and no matter how he looks like. Why? Betzelem Elohim Asa Et Adam. There's an there's a image of God in each person. Betzelem Elohim Bara Adam. And you should just know. There was a story. And it's brought down that it was with Rabbi Lazar Bar Bishimon. What happened? Rabbi Lazar Bar Bishimon learned a lot, a lot, a lot of Torah. And he went ahead and he came back and uh, he was so happy. And Eliyahu Anavi dressed up as, a, uh, as an ugly person, but massively ugly person. And, uh, and he, the ugly person went to the rabbi and says, Tell him, what are you going to be? So he tells him. He didn't look at him like he's so ugly, he's so disgusting. Like if you look at him, it's disgusting. So the Gemara says that Hashem did it on purpose. Like it was a very big test that he was like, not talking about ugly, 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 ugly. Like you think you're so ugly, 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 ugly. Like yeah, it went through off. Like he like, what's going on over here? So he said, does everyone in your town look as ugly as you? <laughs> like, what's going on? So there was a bizayon, a little bit of So he says, I don't know. The out of he answers back. He doesn't know what's the out of the other answers back. I don't know, but one thing is for sure. Go ask the one who created me. Go ask the one who created me. So he's looking at what? I feel so bad. You're right. Hashem created you. Oh my goodness. And he wasn't giving me hey, lies. I'm not going to mochel you. And the whole story goes back, 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 back. And both. Finally, uh, he, he, he said, he met up in the Midrash. He says, always be soft spoken and, 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 and um, soft hearted, I should say. Not so soft hearted to people. Don't be, don't be kasheka. Don't be strong like a, like a, like a cedar tree. Be, 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 be soft hearted person. Be nice person. And this, this, this. So he's telling you over here why one of the inyanim is, every person has imagery of Hashem. Hashem created the person. So now you see a guy, you might see that he's disgusting. He's in rags or this or that. Still, give him the right respect. And I want to tell you something. The more respect you give this person, you can do it. You can make it happen. You're a good person. The more he'll feel confident and he'll actually go ahead and actually achieve what he can achieve. Because the fact that he doesn't have that confidence in him, so therefore everybody's looking at him, oh, so he feels like that. Because he feels like that, so he's going to act like that. You know what I just said? What I just said is very, very important. Because he feels like that, he acts like that. I'll give you an example of my, my own person. What happened was, I remember this past summer, I played with like um, 18-year-olds, basketball. Coming on the court, a few 18-year-old guys, they're coming on the court. So... Uh, so I guess like I'm, I'm gonna play, play ball with the boys, you know. And then one of the guys, one of the few of the boys, eh, I pull out you can't play, I pull out you can't. They looked at me. I saw. Meanwhile, I'm a good ball player. I know how to play ball. Oh Hashem, you know I'm a good, I'm a good ball player. So I'm thinking to myself, and I didn't, I didn't play ball that day like my A game. I didn't play right. So I was thinking, well, after the game, I was like, what? I, I usually hit the shots. I usually drive. I'm able to. To, to dribble like crazy and, and get past anybody. Like, what's going on over here? Able to steal the ball, hustle, what? Then I realized before the game, I heard a few guys saying, hey, man, he's a rabbi, he's a rabbi, he's a rabbi. Meanwhile, I'll take them all down, you know what I mean? Hey, all these guys down, you know? Thinking about like, well, what happened? Because, ahead. because they played the ahead, and, 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 and then when you think like that, you know? You ever see, I remember one time somebody showed me about a boxer, right? You are, I'll be you all. You ever seen the two boxes before they play the game? I'll be you all. You're nothing. You're like a, like my potato chip bag. I'll punch you like a potato chip bag. <laughs> and the guy's like, it's all a wide game. You know what I'm saying? Like, well, the guy's playing ball. He doesn't, eh, you got nothing on me. You got nothing on me. But what? It's all in, in the brain. You click the brain. 
And therefore, when you you, you, you mevazer a person, when you have, heaven forbid, you disrespect a person automatically, and that person feels it. Even if you don't, even if you don't say it, if you just give that vibe like he's a nothing, he can't handle it, then guess what? Inside, he feels that. And it, true, you might be able to handle it. And let's say you have a rabbi, same thing. A rabbi, it's very important that he trusts and he has um, with his students that they can do it. Don't think that they can't do it. Because they feel that vibe, all oh, the other things I can't do. No, 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 you can do it. He has to make sure that vibe is, is evident to the, to, to the students. Oh, let's finish a message. So the rabbi feels that all oh, these guys cannot finish. So therefore, it's automatically projected to the, to, to the students. No, no, the rabbi has to give a vibe. We can do it. You guys have the capabilities of doing it. And, and that will drive it into them as well. This is a very important lesson that we have to understand. Don't ever put a person down and don't ever look out. Even if you don't project, even if you don't say it, don't even project, don't even feel it. Because every person has major potential in him. Because he's, he's, he's in the image of Ebole Olam that Hashem created him. Once Hashem created you as a human being, as an Eshama that you have, you can do great, great, and reach great, you can, you can reach great levels. And therefore, don't ever give a misinterpretation to anybody. Opposite. Give him the confidence that he can do anything he puts his mind to.